Come to InfoWarsKeen.com today and order your first canister of Beyond Tangy Tangerine Complete Multivitamin Mineral Complex Dietary Supplement. That's InfoWarsKeen.com. You've heard and seen commercials about health and a variety of approaches from all over the nation. What would you say if I told you you don't have to do business with someone from far away or some 800 number and hope for the best? You can find as good or even better quality service and products right here in northern Michigan. It's true. Check out eMineral.info to learn more about how their northern Michigan team members have studied minerals in relationship to nutrition and are true believers in natural, healthy living. Check out eMineral.info today or stop in at Hillman Health Foods at 311 North State Street in Hillman. Their hours are Tuesday and Thursday, 9 a.m. to 6, Wednesday and Friday, 9 a.m. till 2, oh. and Saturday, 8 a.m. till noon. That's Hillman's Health Food at 311 North State Street in Hillman. And don't forget their website, emineral.info. That's emineral.info. 94.5 WYPV Mackinac City, Ottawa. 93.9 WAVC Mayo Grayling. We're your Patriot Voice. With SRN News, I'm Keith Peters in Washington. Expect big fireworks on Capitol Hill tomorrow when key players behind the troubled Obamacare website appear before the House Energy and Commerce Committee. Pennsylvania's Tim Murphy is loaded with unanswered questions. Was the site designed poorly because the White House sought to hide it from the public uh, and hide the massive premium increases families are seeing? And why is the president tapping an individual to fix a technology problem without any technology problem experience? Murphy referring to the selection of the former acting director of the the Office of Management and Budget to oversee efforts to fix the website. SRN News Congressional Correspondent Wally Hines reporting HHS Secretary Kathleen Sebelius declined an invitation to testify, citing a scheduling conflict. Sebelius will testify next week. Also at SRNNews.com, supporters of traditional marriage rallied in Springfield, Illinois today to fight same-sex marriage legislation heading through the state legislature. Pastor Mark Johnson of Calvary Temple Christian Center in Springfield says he opposes same-sex marriage because he loves people and doesn't want them hurt. People who misunderstand, they say I'm filled with hate. People who misunderstand, they say I'm a bigot. People who misunderstand, they say I'm narrow-minded. But I know I want nothing but God's best for them. In other news, the Ohio man who confessed online to driving drunk and causing a fatal wrong way crash has learned his fate. Matthew Cordell was sentenced by a judge today to six and a half years in prison. In court today, Cordell apologized to the family of the victim, Vincent Canzani. To the Canzani family, to Michelle Oates, 